Hello everybody, welcome back to Jump Scare Haunts. Um, I know I said I'm going to be doing a few more uh, demo videos today, but I think this will be my last one because I have the other ones put away for now. Um, but uh, this is the grave grabber, the grave grabbing arm. Um, and I got it in the same package as Ellie Hatchet, also known as Ax Me Something. Um, and I'm going to be doing a few animatronics in my uh, graveyard theme this year, even though my main haunt is going to be circus theme. Uh, but I got this prop because I saw it in stores a few years ago and I really liked it. I just never got the chance to pick it up. And um, now I have it. I'm really happy that I got it. It's actually a really cool prop and it's pretty scary. Um, I do have it on battery right now. I got it for like... $50, I think, from GetCoolStuff.com, like I said, uh, but it, uh, the grave tombstone comes into two pieces, just like a lot of the other techie props. The other prop that I have like this is, uh, Guardian of the Grave, yes, uh, the tombstone comes into two pieces, and then goes in between these two prongs on either side of the tombstone like that, so it's very secure. It does come with a weight bag, which definitely added to the shipping, but it's fine. There's a little control box right there, and of course the arm just basically swings around, uh, and it looks like it's grabbing at somebody. So there's the control box right there. It does have volume control at the bottom, and this was one of the only things that I got that's fully working. Um, I also got the breaker, the, out, the outbreaker box. Um, and that was working pretty good. It did have a few small flaws to it, and the hanging surprise scarecrow does not work without batteries. No, it does not work with batteries. You have to use the adapter, and it doesn't come with an adapter. But I'll make a video on that one later. Nelly Hatchet, of course, like I said, uh, is missing the wires for the head, for the, uh, no, for the arms. So I'm going to make a demo of this now. Here's the demo. Motion sensor is. Yeah, the motion sensor is very. sensitive. Let me activate him one more time so you can get a good view out of him. So that's it for the uh, demo part. Other than that, there's not really much to say to it. It does have a very classic tombstone look to it, and um, it's actually a lo pretty good quality. It's I cannot see it breaking anytime soon, which is a good thing, of course. Um, and next time you'll probably see this prop in one of my videos, it will probably be in my haunt video, which is coming in only two or three months now. So it's really crazy. I'm, I'm going to Spirit soon again um, in the next few days. So I may or may not post about that. Depends on uh, if you guys want to see it or not. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I enjoyed making it. And uh, like I said, I probably won't be making any more videos today because I have the rest of my props all packed away already. But I hope you guys are enjoying this these uh, quick, simple demo and review videos. Because they're not too hard to make and I can get them out pretty quickly. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you in the next video, which should be soon.